how can you get to the top? Well, let me give you some tips and tricks. The first thing that you need to remember is that when you're posting on social, you need to give value. Don't think about it as a box checking exercise and getting a task done for the day. Really think about the valuable information that you're giving to a citizen that they're likely not to hear anywhere else. And that's why they'll continue time and time again, not just to follow you or engage with you, but to share your content. Secondly, I would suggest that you should break news on social. Increasingly, we're seeing journalists doing that, making Twitter the digital first platform for breaking news and even breaking news there before it even gets to their publication, their TV station, or even their, their radio channel. So thinking about Twitter for digital PR and breaking news there first. We are hearing a lot about the rise of TikTok in 2021, also Instagram, and then we have the introduction of Clubhouse. But you've got to ask yourself, you know, do we have the capacity to be in all these places? And I always get asked, Joanne, what social network should we prioritize? My answer back to you is quite simply, you need to be where your audience is. You can't really make these decisions around social media strategically about you mostly you have to be where the audience is so i was engaged in a webinar recently and i had somebody from local government in the uk um, saying joanne where should we prioritize our time we don't have a lot of capacity but we're really really keen to ensure that we ha are engaging with with citizens in our locality and quite simply i said Facebook is the local newspaper and the local radio station combined, but then we have an increasingly growth in audience segments going to Instagram where they're really looking for speech and visual content. So for, for them, I advise Facebook and Instagram. So follow where your audience is.